to it so much. I, just want to be the one you love. I, th I think if as long as they keep them separate, you know, like they they make a Fallout 4 that's a story mode, they make a Fallout 5, Fallout 6, but just have that all online alternative so people don't bitch anymore about I want it you know because there's just as many people that want those online versions but I agree like I, I like the offline I like having an offline game I can sink into but there's always been a moment in Fallout 3, New Vegas or even Skyrim where we all said I wish I could be playing with my friend just once maybe just one friend maybe not an online but a co-op you know uh, a three to four player so Um, now, of course, this character is maybe 20 hours out, uh, just hit level 10. Uh, a lot of it's coming back War. to me, and I'm also kind of... I War even, never changes. I'm going to let Romper on talk. Since the dawn of humankind, when our ancestors first discovered the killing power of rock and bone, blood has been spilled in the name of everything, from God to justice to simple psychotic rage. Kind of, yeah. Year Co op like Borderlands or Destiny, of armed conflict, Far Cry, the destructive but the of full story. Sustain itself I have to admit, there's only like a few people like. I love Daisy. The world was oh, plunged into an abyss of nuclear fire and radiation. But it was not, as some had predicted, the end of the world. Instead, the apocalypse was simply the prologue to another bloody chapter of human oh, history. Yeah, Ron. For man had succeeded in destroying the world. But war... War never changes. In the early days, thousands were spared the horrors of the Holocaust by taking refuge in enormous underground shelters known as vaults. But when they emerged, they had only the hell of the wastes to greet them. All except those in Vault 101. Thank you for your on donation! That day, when fire rained from the sky, the giant steel door of Vault 101 slid closed and never reopened. It was here you were born. It is here you will die. Because in Vault 101, no one ever entered. And no one ever leaves. <laughs> Check out Ron Perlman on Blacklist currently. All right, folks, we're going to get going here. Um, uh, Weekend Geek. Let's cover the Weekend Geek, folks. Uh, news possibly leaked from a game tester testing the House of the Wolves. Once again, folks, if you're going to take the job of becoming a beta, alpha, or game tester, you know, and fill out the, 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 the forms and, and Bethesda or Bungie or Rockstar send you DLC to test, and then you leak that information online, you basically just shot yourself in the foot from ever doing it again. and makes it harder for everyone else to do it. But some asshole in Japan was testing the House of the Wolves. And he leaked, like, all, all the stuff, or I don't know. I mean, a lot of it's just buzz over the internet. But it looks like it's March 10th, May 19th, sorry, May 19th will be uh, the possible release date for the House of the Wolves on Destiny, on PS4, PS3, Xbox One, Xbox 360, PC. Um, doesn't really bug me much if it's delayed. Uh, yesterday, unfortunately, I had to go early because I had to make a big dinner for the Familia. And, um... I thought the game froze, because, of course, on, I'm on the PlayStation 3, and Fallout had a tendency to freeze, as well as most Bethesda games. It's okay. There's such good games that when they freeze, it's just time to reload, get reloaded, and stretch. You know, it's not a big deal. But it didn't, and I did win over the Super Bowl. But I saved it right after, and... Uh, that was it. But I want to thank everyone for tuned out yesterday. I mean, you know, like I said, when you play a, a multiplayer game, you get a lot of people that want to play with you. They're they're looking, they're on their phone in front of their PlayStation, looking for a PS3 streamer playing Destiny or Rockstar's GTA or Minecraft or whatever else we play. Even on my PC streaming, my League of Legends, Elder Scrolls, Daisy, 
um, War Thunder, people are always looking to play against and or with me. But when you play a single player game like this, Skyrim, Far Cry, Fallout, Assassin's Creed, UFC or Soul Calibur, uh, a lot of the one, Metal Gear Solid 4, Sense of Liberty is on my to-do list, Oblivion, um, you get really beautiful people like you guys coming in here and watching, interacting with each other and with me. And I want to thank you guys and gals, all you, uh, make sure you guys hit the follow button, it's free, um, and for every follow, I'm trying to get a donation matched for 25 cents or more to help breast cancer research. Uh, I'm trying to get some, a couple different sponsors to donate money for each follower for donations. <clears throat> it's something that I don't see a lot of streamers doing. I see people saying, donate your cash for uh, charity. And we've done quite a few of those here um, in the past. That's where a lot of my big donations come from, from the blue donation banner up there. But uh, America, what's up, Urban? Thanks for tuning in yesterday. Uh, now, unfortunately, I was saving up to get a PS4, and unfortunately now I, the kid has to get braces. I knew that was coming. So once again, my PS4 is put on hold, but we do have a PS4 Xbox One giveaway, one of each month of your choice, um, after we reach partnership. So help us reach partnership, and just give us a follow and hang out view uh, the more the merrier if you got a steam handle playstation handle or xbox handle i'm on all start of samurai i'm on and you can also share your own in the show if you're a youtuber or a streamer please private message me or just say i am a, a streamer or something i it's all about politeness and tact but we run a gaming streaming guild now geekly gaming network we're 67 non-partnered streamers and one of the reasons I stick with non-partners is that you can be partner and come in, but uh, most partnered streamer guilds have, you know, it's just hit or miss on what the rules are, what they would do, but you have to be a partner to have a partnered streaming guild, but it doesn't mean us non-partnered and non-partnered streaming guild people can't hang out together and help each other. Um, I always take a PS4 donated donate it if people want to hook me up, but one of the reasons I still play on the PlayStation 3, folks, is... A lot of you still do, and a lot of streamers and YouTubers have just like, you know, I got next gen, buy old one. What's up? Sit back, spark a fat one, open a cold one, follow, enjoy, type links, mics, rules, and cheat for Nightbot Guidance. I forgot I typed that in there for hey. Drugs Bunny people, make sure you guys go over and follow Drugs Bunny TV on YouTube and on Twitch TV, the Geekily Gaming. VIP. We're going to be on live here in four minutes and 20 seconds. A wink, a wink. Uh, sit right back. You guys can have a, a little peek of what I look like. I'm a sexy motherfucker. And uh, I'm going here just a second. How's everything in the world, people, for you? How's uh, you know, how's the weather for you, cats? How's the New Year's going? Now, once again, people, I know Nightbot types a lot of fucking shit out, but it's to keep my moderators and myself from having to repeat it, and for everyone to know all the rules, so there's no, you know, there's just no miscommunication. It's hard enough to communicate to people you've never met without any type of tone via, via text and stuff. Now, I need to update that geek one heavily. There's um, quite a few people, including the very talented and polite... And honorable, I feel. The Twisted Sigma, everyone. He should be getting his capture card any time. Make sure you hit over and get to his channel on YouTube and subscribe. Um, there's no bad PR and there's no time for PR. Um, now, feel free, people. I have played the main Fallout 3 game. But please be nice about spoilers. We have some Fallout virgins watching that don't know the main story and stuff. Um... I've never played any of the DLC, so definitely don't spoil too much for me. I know some stuff, but like story plot. You can say like, oh, there's this killer gun or this fucked up creature, but like, please, no story plots. Um. But feel free to tell about your adventures in the waste, people. Uh, you can find ours here. It's uh, the Facebook group, The Wastes second from the bottom up you can click on that and head over there and that is um our facebook page for daisy h1z1 dying light uh survival zombie games but it was originated purely for fallout 
and Fallout fans. Now, these groups have been very undermanaged and underused. Facebook's been going through stuff. We've been focusing more on our YouTube and live stream and and for GTVs and doing stuff like that. But please, you know, Facebook groups are, are, are made in there. It's up to you cats to use them. Uh, Alex, uh, a.k.a. the Real Easy A, is part of a lot of them. If you're heavy on... Uh, yeah, I was wondering, um, drugs, how you did that. Um, don't forget, though, we have a lot more of our, our regulars in here are actually on our uh, Twitter. We have Sigma's on there, Angel's on there, uh, Firepower's on there, Dominator's on there, Dragon Pro's on there. You don't have to add them all in, but if you guys don't know... Pretty much like 30 of our regulars here are. Um... Do you have a crew for the PS4 GT5? Well, a lot of our crew is in the PS4 GTA Urban. Uh, the Real Easy A hopped over there. Uh, Game Man's probably going to be hopping over there soon. Uh, Spit 33, one of the original like four horsemen, um, is probably over there. Uh, playing on it, uh, we have a couple, you know, like three commissioners, four commissioners, 10 to 15 lieutenants, probably about 40 representatives that play on the PS4. Um, you know, so if you're part of our crew, right? I'm trying to decide if I want to live in Ten Penny Tower or if I want to live in Megaton this time. Color Splash. Hey, Drugs, did you ever get my message about your, like, Drugs Bunny art that's on your end of show? You may want to be careful with that, by the way. I was watching you yesterday when you went off the air. Terms of service on Twitch are a little sketchy on, like, drug pictures and drug... Okay, no, yeah. You just got to be careful. I'm, you know, the ending art isn't worth having your show, like, suspended. All right, folks, so uh, last we saw my character here. We'll give you a little fallback. Um, day, fuck, I don't know what day it is for my character now. Day, uh, day 19, out of the vault. Life is odd. Life is scary. I've seen things, grotesque things, things I never thought existed. My life was a bubble in Vault 101. Some days I want to return. Some days... I just know I can't. I think I'm just going to be a bit so busy. Yeah, I'm joining. <laughs> it's all good, Irvin. Uh, type in links, people, for him, please. L-I-N-K-S. Uh, Drugs Bunny, yeah, I sent you... Um, I know a lot of you guys' real names, but I'm trying not to use them on the air as respect as the fact we have a little amenity. Um, y your end one that looks like Bugs Bunny smoking a joint with all the pills and stuff. Imagery of narcotics and drugs is against the terms of service. Like, I have, to, I, I honestly, th I've been thinking that I have to get rid of my smoking guy here over my camera because he's smoking either a joint or a cigarette, and both of them are kind of taboo. You know, it's, it, you can, don't get me wrong, but just, just, I'm just saying, like, it's sketchy, it's a sketchy, like, is it okay, is it not? And then you got to wonder, is it worth it or is it not? is being suspended for two weeks or having my show shut down because somebody was offended and reported it or somebody, you know, I mean, just... <laughs> Licks. Length. Uh, the top one there, Urban, is our Destiny link to the Bungie Net. The second one's our Rockstar crew. The third one's my YouTube. And the bottom one, people, is uh, the other network. All right, so, yeah, once again... Um, <clears throat> uh, life out of the vault, hard, 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 whatever. So my character was roaming around, and I was trying to explore and unlock a little bit of the map, as well as just find loot and grind it up, you know, at a level 9. Like I said, folks, I, I haven't done the story. I haven't played this game really in a decade. S but I do remember the fundamental flow of the story. I mean, like, you know, you do this, then the Enclave come, and then you do this. Uh, right now, I think some of my, my goals are very simple, and one of them, of course, is to get to power armor training, 
but first I gotta get strong enough to get to the vault or get through, you know, just 